Welcome back. We are here with 8th of March, Holy Blessing. Now, what is the essence of Holi? And God has been talking about Holi because the Festival of Colors is coming very soon. That is tomorrow and today also mainly. So today is the day where we are going to explore the meaning of how to become a Holy Swan, how to be filled with the imperishable godly intoxication and how to remain pure. So God says on this beautiful day, May you be a holy swan and experience imperishable godly intoxication with your stage of purity. Now, if there is no purity, there is no godly intoxication. If there is no level of complete divinity within us, if we don't imbibe divinity within us or pure habits or pure thinking and pure talking, automatically God's connection with us is limited or let's say next to nil. So God here says on the day of holy. Everyone forgets any awareness of being senior or junior. That means everyone becomes equal in soul consciousness. They consider themselves to be equal and play together with intoxication. They forget, okay, he's my boss or he's my elder sister or this is my father and mother. They just put the colors onto each other and they celebrate as if they are equal. Isn't that so? They forget sanskars of enmity and celebrate an auspicious meeting. So the sanskars of enmity, anything has happened with anyone, bad feelings. Everything is taken away and generally during most of the festivals it is done during Christmas also they forget about everything else right in the time of Holi we forget about everything else in the time of Deepavali also we forget about the enmity and we become equal. They forget sanskars of enmity and celebrate an auspicious meeting. This system is of the present time that means now is the time that we have to become soul conscious and we have to give each other love that means green color we have to give each other power that is red color. We have to give each other happiness that is yellow color instead of just putting the colors you see so this system of the this system is of the present time when your children become holy that is when you stay in your stage of purity golden color and are colored by the color of father's company so godfather's company is purity divine golden rays coming from him entering into me the soul and then into this physical body company then in that godly intoxication you forget any awareness of bodies and what are the awareness of bodies generally what is my age what is that person's age what is my post position what is that person's post position is he my boss or I am his boss or is he my subordinate and all those things or who's senior who's junior all these things are bodily awarenesses awareness of different relationships that's what we spoke about and awareness of senior or junior and junior and simply have the one awareness of soul consciousness we are all equal just playing different roles but those roles are not so important as the one who's playing the role which is the soul this is the stage of a holy swan so if you are a soul playing a role of a boss then you'll be a humble boss instead of an egoistic boss because you are think soul conscious not body conscious this is the stage of a holy swan the memorial of this is celebrated every year in the form of holy. Now, do you understand the meaning of holy? When you are soul conscious, you become holy in your mind and your behavior with everybody else is also holy. No arrogance, only patience, tolerance, humility and directness. Power to face, power to tolerate, power to adjust and that is what is required in every situation. That's how you become a spiritual holy person. With this Om Shanti.